Peace and love, everyone. Got you, bro. Just wanted to say hello. Give y'all a smile. It's a beautiful. I like gray. It's gray outside. It's raining. I got my gray on, too. Matching the sky, matching the frequency, matching what's up. What's down. Yeah. Today, this week should be interesting. We should be seeing what's going on this week energetically. Like I was saying yesterday, make sure that you... Oh, hold on, we'll quit. All right, all right. Sorry, I had to go get the door. Um, go check my mom real quick. Yeah, I was saying right now, even though it's, it's gray outside, I wear my gray and match the frequency, you know, matching time right now. I just want to say be positive. Continue to bring forth change within yourself. Right now, we are heading into the, like I said, the fall. And you really want to try to make this time the time where you get to create something brand new. I was talking about this on my last video. You want to make something brand new for yourself. Build and push it. The winter time comes and that's when you want to, you know, hibernate be a bear having they own everything that you've done throughout the other seasons and now you just want to sleep and hibernate a dream good throughout the winter you just want to dream all winter long for all the work you've done it's a new season so basically what you want to do is put new thoughts in your mind and by winter time you want to hibernate on it then by springtime you want to bring it forth Summertime, that's when you play around with everything you brought forth. Uh, right now, I didn't read my. I'm gonna re read in my book. I love to read. I try to get myself signed into my work computer. Sorry. All right. do this in a while. Did not do this in a while. Uh, this one right here. Goddess Book of Days. I love this artwork. This is a nice tattoo. This be a nice tattoo. I really don't do tattoos, but it'd be a nice one. I don't really, I really don't promote tattoos because I got to tell people, like, hey, you know, whatever you put on your body is what you're trying to evoke. So just be, be mindful of what you put on your body, G tattoos. And, uh, whoopsie, what is October 25th? Yeah, this is a goddess day. This is a goddess book. I love these artworks, man. Old lady. <laughs> yeah, I'm that lady. I love these artworks. Alright. It's another one, too. I've shown this book many times, but I didn't show all the artwork that's in it. But all these artworks, everything that's in here could be a nice tattoo. All right, so October 25th, what goddess is for today? Chinese festival of Hanlu, the moon goddess, and the harvest, a mid-autumn festival. So you may be noticing the moon, of course, giving off that yellow hue. I have I've been looking at it all, all this week. And, um, yeah. Harvest goddesses are Demeter. Now these are all harvest goddesses. God, goddesses. Goddesses. <laughs> goddesses. I just combine harvest and goddess into one word. Goddesses. Boom. That's how that works. Hold on. Let me put my crystal right here. See, this is how this works. This is, by the way, I got a little crystal. Uh, 
This is treat I get. I get. I got some moisture light going on. Let me put this down. There we go. Oh my god. Wow. Let me not break it. Let me not break it. There we go. You can see it now. Boom. I put it on top of here. Yeah. But let me finish up my video here. Harvest goddesses are Demeter, Sir Ceres, Mahu, Spider Woman, Yuki Moshi, Yuki Moshi, Gaia, Guy, Guy Hathor, Rhea, Telus, Martha, Carney, Karna. We have. Uh, Shiko Moto, Kotalik, uh, Dominique, like, uh, Kotalik, yeah, Kotalik. We have moon goddesses, some of them, the, some of the moon goddesses now. So those, those are the harvest goddesses, or the goddesses. <laughs> and now we got the, the moon goddesses, so... So we got both of uh, both worlds here. We got Diana, Hina, Oya. What's up, babe? Uh, Artemis. I love Oya. Oya, awesome. Oya, awesome. Oya, this is awesome. Artemis, Ana Hit, uh, Ana, Shalene, Arzuli, Luna, Haket, Shalari, um, sorry, Shamali, Ata Bay, and Adi Wadu. How they do? And that's right there. It's got, you know, how they do is something you can get into. And some of these names, you know, like Adabe or Adi um most people don't dwell outside of the normal Orishas and all that stuff. You know, get into it. Learn more about the, you know, the other side, you know, the, the, uh, voodoo or hoodoos, you know, voodoo and hoodoo is two different things, but yeah, get into that, the Apollo lineage, <coughs> but those are some of the names right here. Uh, in this book for today if you want to give honor and thanks to the goddesses this whole entire you know week weekend being like a goddess theme really if you're you know, want to give reference to the to the female to the woman now I'm a guy so I like to give a few reference to the woman you know no sense to give reference to myself. I already know what I what I am, so I like to give reference to the woman. So that's what I do. When you give reference to the woman, you give energy to yourself as the man. That's how it works. In my eyes. <laughs> because she energizes you, I energize her. It's a working combination. Bada bing bada boom. Akashi Ra. Thank you for watching. I'm about to um Start my work now. I got my work laptop, everything set up. I hit y'all up with another video. Get back to doing these daily. Peace and love.